is in the warm up. My, my friend is here. I'm just right with Kimura. But since the warm up, and while people are doing the warm up, we start talking about how to move the thumb. Everything should be correct. It should be 100% right since the beginning. Because if you do warm up, you get used to get the Kimura and keep your thumb wrapping around the wrist. When it comes to the fight, that's what you know the muscle memory your friend, your student will have or you will have. Right, so from here, regular Kimura, shoot your arm over the the shoulder. A lot of times when I'm doing the setup, I'm controlling the wrist, wrapping the arm with my thumb. So as I go, now as I'm coming with my arm behind his arm, I'm switching my thumb as well. Okay? So I never do the Kimura with my thumb wrapping the wrist. You guys might know that. So then we go like one, two, and then three, I go for the full Kimura. And then I, again, every day on the warm up, I teach the Kimura over and over. So first thing, I never leave the arm loose. It's always, I tuck my elbow, keep my, his head, Tuck, it's almost like I want him to scratch his neck with his own hand and going back here, right? What we don't do is try to move with the whole arm and leave like this, like moving. So, tuck, here and here. And then back, and then keep going. One, two, and then three. I'll do the full setup. So again, thumb, no thumb, cup in my hand, open the guard, Keeping this foot on the floor, knee squeezing here, my calf locking his lower back, keep his arm tight. How I keep the arm tight is not like doing, just like I tuck my elbow here. Just like this rotation on my elbow, go right here, boom. And again, one, two, three, and we keep doing that for two minutes. Alright? And then you teach him the proper way to do tomorrow. Don't forget the thumb. The thumb, the explanation is pretty simple. Uh, if I go and he extend his arm, extend it, and start like twisting his arm, I have to let go because I'm going to jam my thumb. So the guys that are experts in self defense will tell you about the thumb a lot. Alright? So that's why we protect the thumb, not having the thumb there. So let's go.